Just the one of these four will uh, be unlucky to not make it through to our semis. Down to Scott Cranfield, our starter, who will set these four athletes away. Andy Kenner, 5.25 the white. Tyson Hartill will run from 6.25. In some pretty good form is Brandon Clark as they walk their blocks from 7.75 the yellow. And Brillum Kershaw with the one to catch in the pink from 11 metres. Yeah, off to a pretty good start there was Brandon Clark as he'll close up on the Brillham Kershaw pretty quickly. So Clark it is who takes the lead. Challenging now will be Hartill. Hartill and also the back marker go through and that's Vandy Kenner. So we've seen uh, young Tyson Hartill a couple of times now and he's uh, looking very impressive. But the uh, three of them in uh, Tyson Hartill, Vandy Kenner and also Brandon Clark will qualify. And Brillham Kershaw not too far back there, the pink. So three out of that first heat go through to the semi-finals. And I think you'll find that'll be Tyson Hardhill, Bandy Kenner, and also Brandon Clark. A yeah, good start from Potter to the pink as he leads them out. Coming out in quickly is Callum James, the yellow. Still Potter just in front, ripping through the field nicely is the white of Jacob Nolan. Nolan it is who stretches away and is impressed throughout the day, takes out his heat of the maiden quite convincingly and uh, does a good job in the open gift as well against uh, experienced competitors there, the youngster, Jacob Noel on the white, a clear winner in heat number two of the Sign Ride Hobart gift of 2020. Yeah, so first place, uh, no doubt about it, the white of Jacob Noel and his flag goes into the sky. Second was the red of John Howe from the mark of 4.5. And hanging on for third was Tim Potter, the pink, from 11.5. And the winning time was 11.11. Yeah, away quite well, the whole field. Uh, Smart leads them out in the pink. Coming right through them now is the blue of James and also the back marker there of Moses Kasif. So James and Kasif. Kasif's going to qualify. Probably Whitney, maybe just over James for second. But uh, as we said before, the first three will go through. So I think the back marker, Kasif. And also Whitney and James will be your three qualifiers from heat number three. Yeah, so first was Moses Kasif, the back marker from five metres. Second was the green of Luke Whitney from the mark of 8.25. And third was the blue Logan James. He ran from 7.5. And the winning time there was 11.23. 11.23. Away cleanly, Connor Wright leads them out. Alec Eisel quickly up to him in the yellow as he takes the lead. Moving through the field nicely is Mitchell Branch, the white, along with Lewis. Eisel and Branch go to the line together. Those two will qualify along with the green of Connor Wright, who sneaks into that third automatics position. Yeah, so the white flag goes up first. Mitchell Branch was the winner from 5.5. Second was the yellow of Alec Eisel from 9. And yes, getting that third semi-final spot, Connor Wright, the green from 9.5. And the winning time was a quick one, 10.98. So we've seen the 11 second barrier broken. A 10.98 for the winner, Mitchell Branch there in heat number four. So certainly a change of pace coming up. We uh, spoke about that slight variation in the program where Going to go with our two semi-finals. Right, the pink leads them out. Eisel out quickly, right up onto him. So Eisel leads in the early stages. Coming through the field now is the blue of Jacob Nolan. Still Eisel, still in front. Gaelic Eisel's going to qualify, no doubt about that. Very close for second and third, probably between the blue of Jacob Nolan and the yellow there of Logan James. The other's not too far back. So first across the line, Alec Eisel, the green. He ran from the mark of nine metres. Second was the blue, Jacob Nolan, ran from 5.75. And third was the yellow, Logan James. The winning time in semi-final number one, 10.97. 10.97, the winning time for Ali Geisel in semi-final number one. Potter away quite well as he leads them out. Whitney and Clark trying to get to him quickly. Here comes the red of Moses Kasif as he starts to rip his way through the field along with the white of Mitchell Branch. Kasif it is, he'll take it out close for second and third. Whitney and Branch, I think will be second and third and go through. Good run from the back mark there. Moses Kasif off the mark of five. 
Quickly got up to Mitchell Branch in the white and goes straight through comfortably. Second and third, I think you'll find both Mitchell Branch and Luke Whitney. So, ladies, ladies and gentlemen, and gentlemen uh, shaking, shaking the hands of all the finalists is Ray Quarrell, of course, who's in charge of this carnival. The first runner to go down, down, down the gift track today in the pink. Ali Geisel will run from nine metres. In the green, running from the mark of 8.25, Luke Whitney. Running in the yellow from 7.5, Logan James. Running from the handicap of 5.75, the blue is Jacob Nolan. In the white from 5.5 is Mitchell Branch. And our back marker today from the mark of five metres, Moses Kasif. So there's your six finalists in the Hobart Gift, sponsored by Signright for 2020. Eisel leads them out the pink. Whitney coming up to him quickly. Here comes James in the yellow. Starting to make his way through the field is Moses Kasif, the back marker, and Mitchell Branch in the white. Eisel's still in front. Kasif comes at him. Moses Kasif takes it out from probably Mitchell Branch, the white, and Alec Eisel, the pink. The back marker was too strong today. Moses Kasif just gets there from Mitchell Branch. Big round of applause to the winner of the sign right gift of 2020, Moses Kasif. Congratulations, Congratulations to his coach, coach Scott, Scott Goldsmith, as well. As well. A nice, nice win to Moses, Moses Kasif, his uh, training partner there, Andy Kenner. Kenner. Former winner of this event, 10.62. So the red was first, Moses Kasif from the mark of five. Second was the white, Mitchell Branch. And it was the pink of Alec Geisel who held on to third place. The winning time once again. 10.62 to the winner of the 2020 Sign Ride Hobart Gift, Moses Kasif.